Yeah, what on? Seven figure nigga. Ha. What I know about this. Yo, what is up, guys? It is Editor Joe. Uh, first time I'm being on camera for Banter with Brothers, and I look like a bum right now. So I'm gonna take a shower, uh, tidy up, and uh, get changed. All right, this is uh, this is a lot better. The beard is uh, shaped up, I guess. I don't know. I did it my I did <laughs> I did this on my own. Uh, but yeah, so now I feel a lot better. Uh, I feel good that I change some stuff so uh we can finally start the uh vlog all right so this is a really bad angle of me because one i don't have a proper camera and i don't have a i have a tripod i just don't have like the phone <clears throat> phone connected to it i think i lost it but yeah so i'm the editor of brent banter with the brothers uh, how I met them, uh, Shinny and Garfield, I played club soccer with them at Sacred Heart, um, so that's how I know them, and then AB, on my first, my first time, uh, filming their podcast, I met him, and he's a really cool guy, I, I love them all, uh, I met Carl too, when, uh, when he was here, unfortunately, he's back down in Atlanta, uh, we all miss him, so, yeah, um, uh, just a little bit about me. I'm from Jersey. I'm in Jersey right now with my family in quarantine and self-isolation. Uh, I am a sports media major at Sacred Heart. I'm going to be a senior next semester, which is crazy. And yeah, and I just like editing for them. They're, you know, they're my boys. So, so yeah, so that's a little bit about me. So yeah, I think I've been out away from school for about a month now, almost a month. Um, I had spring break right before March started, and then I came back for a day at Tigard, and then that's when they closed campus. So I was really there for no for no reason. But I've been home for a month. Uh, my my two younger brothers uh, have been home for the same amount of time. One got one. Uh, the youngest has has his uh, high school closed, and the other one's a freshman in college, and his campus closed as well. Um, I mean, we've been fine. Thankfully, no one in our family has been uh, affected by the coronavirus. Um, my dad is originally from Italy and my mom's originally from the Philippines. So I'm a first generation American. And they've been constantly checking in on their on our family that live in each of those countries because at least very like, well hit with the coronavirus. Uh, more cases than any other country now, I think. And the Philippines, even though they're not as affected... Uh, Manila got shut down, which is the capital, um, for, I think, a, a couple of weeks now, and even though m no one in my family n lives in Manila, my mom still is checking on them, making sure that they're okay and stuff, and, uh, and yeah, and hopefully we will all get through this together, and yeah, so let's see how some of the guys are doing with their quarantine experience. Well, I don't know my own school. supposed to be in quarantine, but... I gotta go to work. Yo, fuck this quarantine shit. You're not getting anything. You're gonna say, fuck this pocket. <laughs> Niggas is tripping. You know, we in the green room, but this ain't no audition, nigga. Back the fuck up. There's no one on this damn train. Niggas supposed to be in quarantine. I gotta go to work. Essential my ass. Fuck. <laughs> Kids and hide your wife, they testing corona over there. You heard? Mm hmm. But guess what? I ain't with all that bullshit. You're been up. Yeah, I'm going to work. I'm late, but I don't give a fuck. It's not like, don't give a fuck. It's just that I can't do nothing about it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so I'm about to just walk in here, see what the fuck going on. I know ain't gonna be shit going on, but. So, we're here now, heading back home. Literally no one on the train. Literally no one. I just had to run like a motherfucker. This old lady, old Jamaican lady, want me to call an Uber for her because she missed her train. Boy, the, my shit was like this tight next to my train time and the time the Uber's gonna arrive. 
So I'm out of the brush because the nigga was running like a bitch. And then, but I get the right thing. I did an Uber. It's like $45 or some shit, but whatever. I had to get my good deed for the day. Quarantine and good deal. Or good deed, whatever. Good morning, banter with the brother family. I hope everybody's safe. Following the guidelines, staying home, you know, protecting yourself from any sort of danger that could, you know, come about. So just stay home, you know, be safe. This coronavirus thing is crazy. So we're doing the vlogs over here. This is your boy Shinny, Schindler, you know. Uh, I am most likely, uh, you know, doing everything that they they telling us to do, staying home. I'm currently work for, working from home. So I uh, work for a US congressman here in Connecticut. And so it's a little bit frontline stuff too. You know, people asking questions about uh, legislation, people asking questions about the stimulus package and, you know, me answering the phones and, you know, giving them the information that they would need. Also just, um, you know, helping, you know, doing some cases, so case work a little bit. Um, you know, people, a lot of people, obviously in our office, we deal with immigration, we deal with, uh, you know, a lot of different, you know, aspects, obviously in the community. So uh, just putting into casework, putting casework in and helping the people out, basically uh, in times like this, you know, everybody has a lot of questions, everybody has a lot of concerns, you know, as we all do. And, you know, shout out to our, uh, you know, healthcare professionals on the front line, for real, you know, kind of helping everybody. Well, not kind of, but helping everybody because um, it is a crazy time. But, uh, you know, we vlogging. This is my setup right here, basically. I need to switch it, but um, I'll, I'll show the setup in a little bit, but appreciate it. This is my setup right here, just on my desk. Just nothing too crazy. I got my breakfast cereal, something quick. Put it in the cup, cereal in the cup is dope. It is the best, very best. Can't deny it. Um, so just working from home, basically, um, nine to five, like a regular day. That's what I've been doing since the quarantine has started. So uh, teleworking, but um, you know, it's been, it's been crazy, it's been good, it's been, you know, a lot of successes and there's a lot of uh, obviously failures, but um, you know, that's what you get with, with the work life, especially dealing with, with uh, people and, and things like that. But I'm really happy that I'm, I'm being, I'm taking part of, you know, something to improve uh, what's been going on. Cause there's a lot of, of things that, um, you know, people going through, especially in this time. Um, but, you know, just being grateful that God is using me as a tool to, to be able to, you know, help in this time of craziness. So I'll check back with you in a little bit. Got to get to work. Only could go out for the bare essentials. So that's exactly what I'm doing right now. I'm just leaving the crib to go grab some bare essentials. Um, you know, get some groceries for the house. And I guess it's a little time to just relax work was good it was finished with the work day now it's just you know getting the car get some bare essentials so that's how we do it back home from the hustle and bustle of groceries or whatever um just thankful that we got everything that we needed um you know as you know just chilling so usually what i do in the quarantine um i most likely i've been working out so just being keeping consistent with that and everything like that so just chilling just chilling so i hope everybody's safe you know doing what you got to do to stay inside stay home you know if it's not necessary don't go out um because this thing is a real threat so you know praying for all the healthcare professionals you know on the front line you know we appreciate you we love you you know stay safe god bless What's going on, everybody? First of all, I hope everyone is safe, staying indoors, staying Rona free. Uh, you know, I haven't really been doing that much myself during this quarantine. Really just been chilling, uh, a little bit of reading. Haven't had much work to do since all sports are canceled. So haven't been doing much on that sense, but reading, working out, uh, trying to learn something new if I can here or there. But I haven't been taking videos of it. So I promise y'all for the next vlog, I will be taking more videos. Uh, some more stuff so I can let y'all in on a little bit of 
my little quarantine life. Uh, but I hope y'all are all staying safe. Find yourself a little quarantine partner, a little quarantine, if you will. You know, do what you gotta do. But first of all, and most importantly, I hope y'all are all staying safe. So I hope y'all enjoy what the fellas are doing and I will see y'all in the next vlog. So I wanted to vlog outside. This is uh, Wednesday now. I'm about to edit the vlog. Uh, some of the guys sent me their videos on what they're doing. Uh, what they've been doing in quarantine and self-isolation and how they're handling this situation but I just wanted to update you guys on uh, what I've been doing I mean I have two uh, like I said I have two younger brothers we built a gym in my brother's room and we've just been working out as much as possible obviously we can't we don't have like a lat pull, lat pull down or like some other stuff that a regular gym would have but yeah um, we're just trying to work out as much as possible I uh, went bike riding for a, uh, a couple days in a row now. Uh, I think I'm going to go at some point today. I uh, also want to vlog outside because it is a nice day outside. Um, and what else have I been up to? I actually went out in public uh, to get to go food shopping with my mom. Uh, there's probably going to be some B-roll now with some stuff. And, uh, and yeah, so that was kind of scary. Uh, trying to stay six feet away from each other. There was actually two family friends that we saw in the store and we were just talking like six feet away, like, oh my God, we can't even hug each other, like stuff like that. So yeah, I'm trying to, I'm, I'm trying to keep my part short so you guys can enjoy uh, Shinny's, AB's and uh, Garfield's uh, parts, but yeah. So thank you guys for watching and we'll see y'all next week. Yeah, what I need? Seven figure nigga Ha What they know about this? We know so going to be the last We know so going to be the last We know so going to be the last Yeah We know so going to be the last